right, we're in a mall and we made it to Comics ECC. And the first thing you see when you come in is a huge statue of Boba Fett. That is fire. Oh my God. We got crazy stuff in here. Comics. Let's go ahead and check out this pop wall before we go to the Boba Fett. They got Funko Pops. We got a lot of Marvel. A lot of Marvel. They even got, okay. They got some summer convention exclusives. I love that. Love to see that. And then, uh, yeah, you can hear my girlfriend in the background. Uh, I'm actually gonna have cross hair. Uh, keep on walking. And then we, let's go to this Boba Fett right here. Oh my God, look at this. No, do not touch. Do not touch, but look at this Boba Fett. This is crazy, bro. I would want this in my room. Oh my goodness. This is, oh my God. And they got some DC multiverse figures. Ooh, look at this one right here. Batman, the animated series. I don't know what this is. That's Hagrid. I don't know. They got some anime figures. And then they got a big, huge statue of Batman. And then here, look at all these jokers. That's crazy. Yo, this comic book shop is amazing. Oh my God, look at that alien figure. Look at that giant sentinel battling the X-Men. Yo. This is stuff that I've definitely not seen in any of the comic book shops here. And uh, or back home in Orlando, some Marvel selects, Marvel Legends. Oh, this is dope! This is crazy. Oh man! Oh, here we go! Here we go! This is where we came from. This is the uh, Star Wars figures. I'm definitely gonna have to check these out. I'm gonna have to pause this video because it looks like they have some stuff. So here I found the uh, vintage uh, collection. You see a little Annie here, right? So let me just show you the prices here. So right now this at walmart.com in the US is like 5.95. You come here, this is 24 euros. So 24 euros equals like about $27. So this is the reason why I'm not taking anything back with me because this is way too much. And obviously I could get it at a cheaper price, but the, the crazy thing is they have still episode one little Annie. So it's not even a vintage figure. This is actually episode one, which I do have this at home. Look at that, Obi-Wan. And this is, well, not that bad, 15 euros, but still it's like $17 back at home. So let's see what else they have here. Mm, Palpatine, yeah, Padme. Damn, but they have a lot of figures here. They even got Power of the Force figures. These are old, folks. These are old, okay? $9.99, not bad. You know, this is not bad. I think I could probably maybe grab some of these if they're all 9.99. But like I said, a lot of these are very expensive and overpriced. I would definitely want to grab that Darth Vader and that Mando, but you know, they're very overpriced. Let's go ahead and check the price of that right now so you guys can see. So the Mando, 24 euros, okay. Darth Vader, my favorite, 24 euros. And then, you know, I know Tony's been asking me for this one 
Uh, he's like, dude, man, if you see this in Europe, please, or Spain, get this from me. So I got you, bro. But not for 24 euros, Tony. You're going to have to wait for that to go on sale, buddy. Then you got Black Series figures here as well. Let's go ahead and check this out over here. Yo, look at the, oh my God. Look at that Darth Vader right there. How much? 699 euros, let's zoom in. 699 euros. Oh, this is exactly what I want my house to look like. I would like my bedroom to have all these statues. This is crazy. They even got lightsabers. Oh man. Ahsoka. Look at tech. RIP tech. I got some sodas here. Grogu. Oh my god. Look at this. Book of Boba. Mando riding that little dinosaur. How much is that? Let's go zoom in. 799 euros, folks. <sighs> SH Figure Arts, Dragon Ball, Sailor Moon, Chainsaw Man. Ooh, look at Luffy. Look at Luffy and the Gold Mary. These are all dope, bro. I got some dope stuff behind the counter, too. I still got more part of this store to check out, but yeah. They got dope stuff, but again, you could definitely find this stuff a little bit cheaper in the U.S. Look at this one. I got Ghostbusters. Oh, man. Got Funko Pops here. Let's go here. I come and see. I got more on this side. Look at the helmets. Oh my God. Half bus. Stormtrooper. Helmets. I got that Darth Vader helmet right there. Gremlins. The Bride of Chucky. Yo. This is sick. Look at Link. Link right there. Oh, Mario. Oh, man. This is my girlfriend just trying to be part of the video. Uh, and she knows I have that helmet. I don't know why she asked me. All right, there goes my girlfriend trying to be part of the video again. But, uh, here is all the Funko Pops. Wow. Look at this right here from Stranger Things. Oh man, they got a lot of stuff here, bro. A lot of stuff, way more stuff than I see in the comic book shops in Orlando. Oh man. Let's go ahead and check the price. All right, so this is a basic Luke right here. Let's see the price. They want 16 euros. So that's about maybe 16, 17 dollars. And this is just a basic pop. No, it's not exclusive. So just to let you guys know the different prices and why I'm not taking any of this stuff back home with me. Because it's very expensive compared to US. And I think I do need this loop too. <laughs> He also got Star Wars books in Spanish. Star Wars Objectivo Vader. So, we go open up some of these pages. You'll see that it is in Spanish, folks. I don't know what this book is about. But, you know, Vader doing his thing. But it's in Spanish. So that's pretty dope. All this stuff, these books right here, Star Wars stuff, Spawn, all these comics are all in Spanish. 